All right, what's up, y'all? Um, today we will be doing a unboxing of the GoPro 10. So, um, I bought it at Costco. It was on sale for three thirty nine, I believe. And um, I got it so I can do better POVs with my photography. So I really hope that um, it works out. So instead of having a big bone on my chest right here, because uh, usually I record, I'm going to have the GoPro now. And after we have it all set up, then we can see how it comes out. The quality-wise, I guess. Even though the quality on the Samsung, in my opinion, didn't come out bad. But um, when I would walk with my phone and not realize that... Uh, the the chest strap wasn't on right it would bounce a lot so a few videos that i've posted on my tiktok just bounce and so hopefully this helps out and this was 339 and it comes with the two batteries um let's see there it is gopro 10 and it comes with the, the two batteries um the sd card 64 sd card so it is on sale right now it's a good grab so if you guys want a gopro I would highly recommend it. I, I didn't want to get the 11 just because um, it was a little overpriced for me. So let's get this bad boy open and then we will see. I'll show you guys everything. We'll plug in a battery. We'll see how it works and so on. And hopefully I can attach a video of it too as I'm turning it on right now too. I'm not that good at editing yet. So I don't know how this is going to work after I post this video and how I can do it. It comes in this nice little case though, by the way. Um, which is cool. That was part of the bundle kit. Ooh, fancy. Okay. So this is what's inside of it. So the charger, which is right here. The GoPro. The little mount thing. Um, and then the two batteries, one, two. So I won't go too much in detail with the rest of the stuff. I don't want to make this video too long. So let's get the GoPro out and let's get it started. Hold on, let me close this door up. If you guys can hear the background, right there, but oh, sorry. We might end up having to clip part of this video just because like i said i don't want it to be a long video i just wanted to do the unboxing of a gopro and then uh see how it ends up being and then uh i will upload the video right and then i'm assuming i would have to once i turn this on i would add this clip to that one yeah anyways we'll get to it um the difference in the gopro 10 and the gopro 11 was the smooth civilization it's like this one's 4.0 instead of 5.0 and then the GoPro 11 also has the other option as far as um, the crop of the video. So it's like, uh, I think it's like 1080, 810, and then 7 something. I think this one doesn't have the 810 option as far as size goes, which to me, I don't care. I'm always going to be using the 1080. Um, so let's put a battery in this bad boy. So this is what the GoPro looks like. Okay. There's the the modes. Like I said, this is my first time unboxing. I've never had a GoPro. So I figured why not open it, share with you guys the experience, um, how hard or easy it is to set it up. Um, from my understanding, the opening of it is on this side over here. Uh, how do we open this? I don't know. Oh, okay. So, um, this little button right here, we're going to push down on it, and then it's going to open up. There you go. And then um, we're going to open this little battery. Hi, buddy. That's my son in the back. 
Uh, I'm assuming that little tab stays on there. Uh, I don't know again, so I'm gonna leave it like that. I'm not gonna mess with it. Um, no, no, open it right now. How to close this? I don't know, but I'm struggling to close it. I thought it would be easier. Oh, there it is. Okay, so I guess you just kind of like, so to open it, right, you're just going to pull down on this and then pull up. And then to close it, you're just going to close down. And then you're going to um, push in like that. All right, cool. Hope that helps. So we're going to hold down the power button. And it is on. It's uh, starting up right now. And um oh look you can see now we're gonna go to the options do the english uh using the gopro we're gonna agree to the terms and then it says if the location we're gonna turn that bad boy on install gopro quick app on your phone to finish setup leave your camera on and follow the app instructions uh oh i'm using my phone to record so unfortunately i won't be able to do that um, actually, we can skip it. It actually lets you skip it. Hopefully, you can read that. I just backed up. So, yeah, let's skip setup. And then uh, we're just going to put the date, which today's date is uh, May, May 3rd, 2023. And the time is... 1738. Sorry, I made that face because my wife came in and with my son, I'm like, don't come in. I'm trying to do this unboxing right now. You know, we're going to do 24 hour thing, whatever. Yeah, there you go. I like the 24 hours. So there you go. We set up the time. Oh, snaps. You can totally see how clear the, like, the screen is. I'm going to buy a protect on it. So. Update time and day automatically by connecting the GoPro Quick Up. So I'm going to set it manually just because. I don't know why it's making me do it again. We just did this. So we're probably going to edit this out. 24. What was it? 1739. Date and time updated. Kachow. Me video performance mode. Okay, cool. Swipe to access them on dashboard. Cool. So there you have it. It is on. Wow, that looks really good. Actually, that looks amazing. It only has 5% battery, so it might die. Um, no SD card. So we got to put in the SD card, dang it. Otherwise, it won't record, I, I presume. I don't know how long the battery will last. Look, there's an the instruction. So you guys didn't need to, to see me struggle but it does come with instructions which is a good thing right but my dumb ass um decided not to follow them i don't know maybe it's a guy thing i don't know typical anyways back to opening this like i said it came with the sd card which is cool that's why i bought it um 64 though it'll probably only give you like if you're recording in 1080 i believe it's only going to give you like four hours six hours and then if you're doing 4K, it's only going to give you like an hour and a half. So you definitely need more memory if you like recording on high quality. Um, and then uh, let's see here. No, no, I need the SD card. So how am I going to open this? Let's see, guys. Do I have something to open it with? Nope. It says open here, but I was definitely not prepared to have issues opening this. So here we are struggling, but we will get it, I promise. Okay, there it is. I'm opening it now. Um, oh, well, that was a fail. That was a fail again. Okay, what the heck's going on here? I 
I think it turns off on its own too after a while. Yeah, it does. Okay, cool. Now the batteries are charged. Okay, I might have to BRB. Real quick, let me open this. I'm not gonna show bloopers. I'm gonna show bloopers, whatever. You know, first time for everything and it's showing what really happens behind the scenes. Anyways, we got the SD card, so let's put the bad boy in there. Which is where? Where do we put it? Where is she? Okay, so the SD card is gonna go right in there as well. Okay, so let's put the bad boy in there. Which way? I don't know. Should I check to make sure we're not putting it in the right way? Yes. Um, so if the screen's like this and it goes like this, I think it says to put it in like this. Nope, it doesn't go in that way because it doesn't fit. Okay. All right. So there you go. Now we have it. So we don't want time warp. We don't want time lapse. Wide, we definitely want wide. And then, um, video, there you go. We got the video. And then we want cinematic, ultra slow mo, basic. So let's do basic because I think that's what I'm recording on my phone. So we'll do basic. And then we'll do the 60 frames per second. Which basic doesn't look that good to be honest, but it's okay. So then we'll just hit the record button, right? So two hours, we can get two hours on 1060. And then um, how do we start recording? I don't know. But it's supposed to start recording automatically, but I don't know. It's about to die on me. So do I just, there you go. So it's recording now. So let's see. Oh, actually, look, like, that's pretty good. Captures quite a bit. And like I said, it's about to die right now. So I'm only going to get a few seconds in. But there you guys have it. There's a GoPro 10, and I will post the results of this video quality up with it too. And um, we'll see how it looks. And um, hopefully it works out. I might have to get the adapter for the wide view on it. Um, I'm going to turn it off now. But uh, so you guys can see how the quality is. Yeah. So let's stop that now. Check out your media, swipe so the GoPro video. Okay. So we'll leave that there. We'll hold on the button. Oh, no, no, no. We'll figure out how to turn it off. But there it is. And um, I don't know how to end the video, but uh, I just want to say thank you guys for sticking through my awkwardness of opening and unboxing a GoPro 10. And um, the likes and the subscribes would help a lot so I can continue growing my channel. And like I said, I'm very happy just because now I'll definitely be able to do more POV street photography, which that's the long-term goal. And then eventually grow from that. Um, so I really appreciate you guys. And um, I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace out, y'all.